This is Jeff Mucci with RCR Wireless News. We're here at day two at Mobile World Congress 2012 with Jonathan Burrell, who's marketing manager for Anritsu for the EMEA region. Jonathan, thanks for joining us today. Thank you. Uh, tell us a bit about what you're doing with LTE here at the show. So a uh, key highlight for us we're looking at is the, the LTE advanced and the launch of the uh, high data rate advanced technology for the next generation beyond the current LTE. In addition, we're looking at the voice over LTE, which is one of the big challenges of making it work in the real world. So we have several demonstrations of voice over LTE and some of the key technologies involved in making that work. So the product we're demonstrating here today is our MD8430 advanced signaling tester, which is an LTE network simulator for testing a handset. We've teamed up with Signalion, who's a producer of the UE simulator for network testing, and together made the world's first IoT testing for LTE Advanced. This means the next generation of technology is implemented and proven, and we can demonstrate the higher data rates of the new technology. So we're able to show today 300 megabits data rate download using this standard, using the technique known as carrier aggregation. So here we set up two separate carriers, each on 150 megabits downlink, aggregate them together so there's a net data rate to the user of 300 megabits. And this is easily seen on the Anritsu equipment where we show, show two separate 150 megabit, 20 megahertz carriers running together simultaneously. So this now gives us a non-contiguous carrier aggregation technique. So this carrier aggregation shows us how carriers can overcome the problem of bandwidth and capacity because now they can use two simultaneous pieces of spectrum to service one user and give you double the data rate on the network. 